When people ask me about optimising performance, they often say, what can differentiate a great performance from a, just a good performance? Uh, obviously, I've got a biased opinion on this, but research would indicate that the people who develop emotional skills, that's an awareness of their own emotions, how they deal with themselves, uh, other people's emotions and how to manage them to get the best out of them, and also setting the right environment, these are the people who seem to have the edge in life and become good to great. So my view would be work on emotional skills and that will improve performance. When I'm working with people in any aspect, whether it's medical, whether it's sport, whether it's business, or even personal development, um, what I do is ask the person to work as a team with me, and what the CHIMP model is, it's a tool to access the mind and then apply it to whatever area of work or business pleasure, whatever it is they're trying to do. So it doesn't really concern me what it is they're trying to do, provided it's realistic. What I'm trying to do is get them to engage their mind so that it optimises the performance within that particular field. When it comes to working with teams, the rules change slightly. With an individual, I always see them as the king or queen. They're the monarch of their world and they must make decisions about what they want to do and how they want to do it. When you join a team, the rules change. At that point, you have to respect the team leader or if there are a number of people, if it's a, a committee, then you respect the rules of the committee, the way in which the committee wishes to operate, and then we get people to buy into a team value and a team thinking. So what you get is rather than an opinion, which individuals will have, you get a collective opinion, which is agreed upon and then everybody endorses it. So my role would be to try and get the team to do that, uh, everyone to respect the rules of the team and then everybody to buy in and then use their minds optimally for that rather than their minds fighting against each other and creating problems within the team.